We share stories that give you a boost. It's time for 102 seconds of good. I love this story. It is about a nurse who kind of a kind of a, a soft spoken, a listener, they say. And she was always very aware of the things and the people and the needs around her. A few years ago, one of the nurses at the hospital where she worked got sick and had to take a considerable amount of time off of work. Uh, While she didn't know her very well, of course, she was a listener and she knew that she had three kids and that honestly she needed the work. The hospital policy allowed for the sick nurse to have six weeks off with pay. But then after that, it was without pay. At lunch one day, she heard some of the nurses saying, hey, why don't we start a GoFundMe? Why don't we do something like that? She says, why don't we do something better than that? And I mean, they're like, wait, hold on. She's talking because she's usually pretty quiet. So so everybody looked at her and said, well, what do you think? She said, well, everybody loves her. She's always doing kind things for people. Each of us has three 12-hour shifts a week. All we need to do is find three nurses each week to volunteer for an extra shift. The other nurses looked at her and said, wow, that's, that's a great idea. She said, I'll organize the schedule. So every week after the six weeks that she was off, there were three nurses who volunteered an extra shift for her so they, to make she got sure paid, that so, she got her wow. full salary. You want to know how long she was off of work? Three years. What? Yep. That is love right there. Man. That is good. Wow. And that is paying attention, hearing the needs, and meeting the needs. And... uh We are so glad to share it with you in our 102 seconds of good here on Big 102.1. If you've got a story, whether it's a link to something you read, an article from a magazine, or something that happened in your world that you want to type out and take a couple of minutes to do that, send those to us to the Big Morning Show at Big1021.com.